you remember last time I did a video about a boost event uh, integrated in our package? So, uh, in that video I said, uh, if we reached 50 likes, I'll be making another way to detect, to detect boosts without my package. And yeah, we actually made it. So, uh, after all requested that I make part 2 for this, or the other way to do this, I am here right now, today, making it. So, without further ado, let's hop into the video. Alright, so here we are. Let's start by going to our events folder. Okay, here. Uh, we will be using the message create event. Yeah, a little bit odd, but I'll explain. Uh, actually, I don't want to do it in the same uh, file. I'm going to just create another file called boost detector. And uh, it will be a message create event normally. So boost detector to JS. Alright, I'm going to just delete this. Okay, and this as well because we will not actually need that. So, uh, yeah, you might want to put a schema there if you want to make it multi gold. If not, that's totally fine. So, uh, of course, we will need the message content intents. So, if you don't have it, uh, this way will not work with you, and you will probably need to watch the old, the old video. So, let's go to the docs to explain how this works. So, uh, let me go to the message type. Alright, here as you can see, there is tons of types of the messages. Okay, so let me make an array actually. So, uh, it will be like, oh, let boost... Uh, types or message types actually message types equal all right and that's the array so let's come here and discover what we've got here so do you see these three or four types okay let me grab them here all right so look over here we got the user premium Guild uh, subscription. That's basically whenever someone boosts. Okay, uh, we got here user premium gold subscription tier one. Basically, when someone boosts and the server gets level one boost. Okay, as you remember, as you know here, I went here. There is le the levels here, as you know. So, yeah. And that's level 2 and that's level 3. So what we're going to do is just basically get them into an array. There. Here. And here. Uh, I can leave them here. Alright, one thing you need to remember is to make sure that you got intents. Alright, so... Guilds. Guilds members. Girls' messages, okay. So uh, now that we got an array of the message types that are actually boosts, so whenever we see this, it means it's a boost. So you will ask me, how will we know the author if the system actually who sends it? So basically, if I went here and went to boosts. Alright, let me thank my guy here. Okay. Let me, if I scrolled all the way up, all the way up, all the way up. Two hours later. Here we are, finally, after scrolling way too much. Okay. Uh, you see, we got he, these. Okay, that's normally whenever someone uh, boosts. So, if you got the author of that message, which normally the system who sends it, if you got the author of it, you will get the booster as the author. Okay, so uh, 
if I did uh, uh, here if uh, array or like message dot types dot includes and here we'll need to put the message dot type okay so let me show you something actually if I went here and did console.log message.type and run the bot let me just send any message okay here look default default here is the normal message that gets sent okay let me try to uh, a reply look reply see I got a reply here and as you can see there is a reply type over here so yeah uh, here we are so I'm gonna just remove that with the back and yeah one basically saying here is if the message dot types uh, hold on not dot types message types in the array dot includes message dot type okay we want to do something which is like send let me just test it message dot channel dot send detected okay let me add here a default okay or a reply actually all right so look at this now if i try to send a message like that nothing will happen correctly okay but if i try to reply to it detect it see because we have the type into the array perfect so now what we can do actually is get the author so let me show you how you will just do here dot message author that's it see that that now sending nothing happens replying there we go that's basically the id for some reasons it didn't actually ping me uh yeah that's it will be old let me try again yeah i don't know why i didn't actually put it but what you can do is just put it like that hold on if we did let me just change the entire thing there message.author and just put this maybe that, that's something new into the discord.js probably now if i try to, to apply for real like okay i just noticed something new that i didn't even know if i did send and did detected plus like detected into a string plus message.author it sends here the id but if i did it as like that it sends it normally okay that's something i didn't actually know but yeah here we go as i just showed you it replies there hold on there all right so yeah that was easy actually now we go just remove the reply that's it that's the entire code by the way uh let's do like an embed const message just and you're gonna actually put here how many so it was something like message dot gold dot premium subscription i guess yeah i got let me let me check it real quick 
uh, premium. No, that's not the roll. I didn't mean the roll. Gold. Let me just go there. Premium, premium, premium. Yeah, here we go. Period subscription total number of boosts in this server. And boosts. Do message or channel to send embeds. Embed. Alright, so uh, we will not be able to test it because I used both of my boosts, so yeah. But I already showed you how it will work, like, let me just do it once more again before we end the video. Here, no dot, sending normal messages will not work, but if I send a reply, as you can see, it, should, it replies with that. You can also add the color, because why not? Uh, pink. Is there a boost color? No, let me just put be pink. My god, all of that to just put pink. <laughs> yeah, there. Okay, so... Yeah, that was it. If you just put it and try to boost, it will work. Uh, that was it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And leave a comment down below what you want the next video to be. That's it. And ciao.